TV is changing in dramatic ways. Like, so true. Like, one of the things, and it's a little weird sitting above the Comcast logo having this conversation because they're on both sides of the conversation. They're a big media company, but they're also making all kinds of smart investments in little niche, high quality verticals. You know, so, so they've got their bases covered. So I can hug the pillow again. Okay. Um, <laughs> I, I think that the thing about hacking TV is you have to start by knowing that in five years, it's not going to be what we think it is. To, it's not just, you know, conventional cable television ported into HTML and delivered d d through a different pipe. It's really not. And if you look at the, the consumption habits, so I'll give you a perfect example. In my staff meeting on Monday morning, I said to my team of mostly 20-somethings, you know, how many of you watched House of Cards? And of the 15, 18 people in the room, four hands went up, and I said, how much did you watch? And one person had watched 13 hours. Whole thing. I mean, that's the way of the future. The binge watch is just but, the but, way everyone wants more and more content. But that's why I push back when people say, well, you know, kids today, they just watch short things. They only want to watch 30 second, you know, little, it's like, yeah, or 13 hour things. Yeah. Like longer, shorter, which just simply means different.